all doing well welcome back to another video so please excuse my hair i'm literally on that day where i need to wash my hair i mean i know i have been supporting a bit of a slip rick at the moment but yeah it wouldn't normally be this i don't know do you know when you can just kind of tell when you slick your hair back when it's greasy as to when it's not greasy like i think because you know you feel it more um but yeah Anyway, hope you're all doing well. Welcome back to another video. So today, I'm finally getting around to filming a super exciting video that, to be honest with you, I've been wanting to film this for the past couple of Christmases. But as you guys may or may not know, this time of the year is honestly and genuinely the most craziest, busiest time of the year for me. Black Friday is just... I don't even have the words. I literally uploaded a video every single day, which was just so full on and crazy. But then I have Christmas content as well. And then obviously we've just been Christmas um, and things to sort out with Christmas and wanting to socialize because I feel like this year we can actually socialize a little bit more. And um, now COVID restrictions and stuff have eased a little, dare I say. Um, yeah, just a busy, busy time. But this year I have finally managed to put together a small business gift guide, which I'm super excited to share with you. I just want to say firstly a massive Thank you to all of those businesses for kindly sending everything over. Um, it's always a bit manic trying to organise everything. And obviously I didn't want to miss anyone out. And obviously you know what Royal Mail can be like at this time of the year. So yeah, thank you, thank you to you guys first of all. Um, and I also just wanted to say as well, sorry, I'm really rambling in this intro, aren't I? Um, it's really made me realise the importance of shopping locally. I'll be very honest and hold my hands up. I don't always shop locally. And I think it's just so easy and accessible sometimes to just go in a shop and pick out a gift um whereas you know i think sometimes you have to think like there's so many small businesses that could really do with our support and our help and not to mention i feel like a lot of the times when you shop small so much more thought and care goes into a product than when you buy it off a shelf in a supermarket or, or just like a standard shop and um, that's huge so yeah it's really opened my eyes i must admit because like i say although i do shop a lot on etsy and places like that and i do buy personalized things and a lot of things from small businesses i feel like this has just made me realize even more so so i hope it does you as well and if you can support any of these small businesses featured in this video then it would mean so much or even if you could just follow them like that would mean just a lot in itself so yeah if you can follow please please do so i'm gonna leave all of the instagram handles to these brands in the description so in no particular order the first thing i want to share with you is actually from a lovely lady called cheryl um, now her instagram handle is chocolate underscore gifts and favors and she has has actually been doing a small business on the side of her main business i believe um selling chocolate slabs um so honestly i can't get over how amazing these are like when i opened this parcel i just it's so adorable honestly it genuinely made me emotional like i am literally the most emotional person just to know like the time and effort someone's gone into something like this because it's just so intricate and stunning and um, so yeah the chocolate slabs and she does all different various designs so anything to suit anyone basically she will personalize them for you your individual whoever you're buying for um so she sent me an assortment so this obviously is a personal fave it's super girly um and it is like a coco chanel inspired chocolate slab oh my god honestly just how stunning is this guys so we've got like the chanel bag on and just loads of beautiful detailing like little pearls and then it actually says a girl should be two things classy and fabulous fabulous and um, coco chanel and it's just stunning honestly just so pretty just say all the ingredients on the back as well and obviously like the date it goes out of date and stuff i've not actually tried the chocolate yet like it's one of these things that just looks that good that i don't even want to open and eat um but yeah how adorable would that be for a gift for someone um just like a little something even a stocking filler so yeah that's that and then there was also two other designs that she sent over by the way they all come bubble wrapped um and obviously you know really well packaged they came in individual boxes too so that's nice you've got a little box and obviously all the bubble wrapping in so it's not going to get destroyed in the mail uh, but yeah for a gamer this would be perfect it says world's best gamer um i love that like look at the little playstation remote again just all of the um candy candy i'm not american i don't know why i'm saying candy sweets <laughs> um, sorry i feel like candy is just a very american term we don't really say candy over here we say sweets so i don't know where i got that from i think it's because i've been watching too much selling sunset and obviously that's american um 
But yeah, anyway, that's a gorgeous one. And then the last one, I haven't actually unwrapped this out of the bubble wrap yet. Um, this, oh my God, this is a gorgeous one too. So this actually has some like Nike trainers in, in like white chocolate. And then it also has this little coffee cup. And again, just like look at all of the sweets around it and how pretty and colourful it is. These honestly are just so incredibly stunning. And I just think for me as well, like the amount of time and effort that has gone into each individual one. You can personalise it like I say. And I just think it's a beautiful way to give someone chocolate. And it's something different. So yeah, please, please check out Cheryl's Small Business. I, like I say, will leave all the details in the description box. By the way, guys, pricing and stuff, I don't obviously know off the top of my head. So, like I say, I will leave all the links to everything so you can just check it out yourself that way. It's just a little bit easier than me reading off wrong information or if prices change or anything. Okay, so moving on to the next small business. Now, this small business sent me over so much stuff. Like, I had the biggest box full of candles, wax melts, reed diffusers. And honestly, again, it was just another moment where... Guys, I was an emotional wreck receiving all of these parcels. Like, you asked Mitchell, I genuinely was just tearing up, like, just looking at all the detail and everything. I was just, I don't know what's wrong with me. So anyway, this next small business is a company called Coastal Melts. Um, the founder is Anita. And yeah, she runs her own home and fragrance business, selling loads of different beautiful candles, like I say, wax melts and reed diffusers. Now, let me tell you now, this lady again has just put in so much work into this like the branding packaging everything it's just beautiful so first we're going to start with candles so these are the christmas candles that she sent me over so we have um the like swing ticket on it which says homemade candle coastal melts on like the branding um this gorgeous little like reindeer charm as well which i just think is such a beautiful touch the candy cane is in this gorgeous red velvet like pouch let me try and open one i didn't even want to open them just because they look so stunning i think i did open this one which should be a little bit easier for me to open okay so i opened this one so this is the christmas eve candle honestly one thing <laughs> i really want to stress when i open this package is the scent coming from the box like Oh my goodness, it smelled absolutely insane. Like almost like I could eat it. So this is the Christmas Eve candle, which is candy cane, peppermint, fruits. This smells blooming lovely. Oh my goodness. So this is what the candle itself looks like. It is a two wick candle in this beautiful glass pot. Okay, and then she was so kind enough to send me two reviews over. I was really like conscious of like unpacking everything. So I wanted to obviously show you how it comes. Again, it was so beautifully wrapped and everything was taken really good care of. Um, so this is how the reed diffusers come again in this gorgeous packaging. Just I love the branding of everything with these little like charms on, candy canes. Um, and this is the Christmas night one, which is gingerbread allspice caramel. Sounds so good. I'm not going to actually unbox that one, but I did unbox one the other day. Um, just so you can actually see what the reed diffuser looks like with like the reeds in and everything. And how stunning is this? Like I just love how kind of like minimal it is, but then it's got all these gorgeous like seashells in the bottom. Like how pretty is that? Um, I love black reeds as well. Like anyone that knows me and knows my love of reed diffusers, I'm really fussy with reeds. I just think black always makes them look a lot more expensive. Um, yeah, this is the Christmas tree one. Um, and it smells so, so insane. I've got this in my hallway at the moment. And every time I walk through the door, I'm like, oh my God, what is that smell? And I'm like, oh yeah, it's that reed diffuser. Um, so yeah, absolutely stunning. And then we also have two more pouches so i think one's got another candle in which i'll quickly get out and i'm not too sure what this one's got in i've not opened it yet so it's a surprise for all of us over here let's have a look oh my goodness it's more wax melts how lovely is it honestly this is just so incredible oh so this is the christmas collection wax melts that she sent me over oh my god there's so many right so we have christmas tree at christmas night we have Christmas morning. Oh my God, you can literally have a wax melt on for every like Christmas, like part of the day. Christmas past, Christmas Eve, and then Christmas day. Again, these, I can't tell you how good these smell. Like they smell so strong. And like, do you just know they're gonna be good wax melts? Oh my goodness, they are amazing. So yeah, they've got a Christmas collection if you'd like to treat yourself to some Christmas wax melts. But she also sent me these wax melts too, which again are Christmas scented ones, but they just come in this packaging instead. 
so so pretty again so i got four of those okay and then the last candle let's have a look what scent this is i just wanted to get everything out so we can you know see everything oh so this is christmas pass this is frankincense myra and amber oh my god i think that is what i can smell that smells so good so anyway that is coastal Mel's, and honestly they are beautiful they have some stunning stunning bits so please check them out and like i say i will leave their instagram handle in the description so you can go ahead and follow them too okay so moving on to the next small business now the next small business i'm going to be sharing with you is actually a jewelry brand um and this jewelry brand is honestly so incredible so they're actually a little bit different in the sense that they recycle and rework designer pieces which is honestly just insane so if you're looking to get something designer but without the hefty price tag then getting something that's been recycled and reworked is a much more affordable way to do so and honestly they look incredible so um she so kindly allowed me to pick something out and i went for this chanel necklace honestly i can't wait to wear this like i'm literally blown away like how amazing this is so this is the necklace it comes in a gorgeous box with obviously the branding of the brand on and then yeah this is the necklace itself like look how beautiful the chain is um we have the chanel like pendant here so incredibly stunning this would be a perfect day necklace um i think i think it's gonna be a really easy piece to wear um it also came with a jewelry polishing cloth to make sure you know you look after your jewelry which i thought was a really nice touch of the brand also a really nice thank you note that's laminated it, again these little things just show so much um about a brand and their care and attention to detail jewelry care on the back how to care for your jewelry so yeah this brand has some really special pieces on the website they're all so unique as well because obviously they're recycled and reworked so if you're looking for that luxury jewelry piece to perhaps give someone or treat yourself to then yeah definitely recommend having a little look at oriana okay so moving on to my next small business now and this next brand is another kind of like lifestyle home type brand and they are called luna gifts so again i'm going to leave their instagram handle on screen and also in the description box so you can go and give them a follow and support them on instagram um and they honestly sell some stunning beautiful things so they do like dried flowers homeware things for your kitchen yeah they have a ton of different stuff so definitely check out their website and they were so kind to send me one of their pampas grass kind of like wall arrangements that you can hang up um you can kind of like use this as a wreath as well do you know like put it over like your door handle i think that looks really pretty but yeah like i say you can hang it up anywhere in your house it is just a stunning decorative piece. So this is what it looks like. They actually sent me over a little note with the parcel just to tell me a little bit more information. So this is called the Pampas Snowflake. The cost of this is 45 um, or a larger one is available for 65 And then they also kindly sent me over a bauble. Um, and the bauble is 5 99 So it's just a gorgeous glass bauble filled with pampas. If I just come in and show you. The quality of this is insane. And then again, it has this gorgeous ribbon arm. Uh, they actually have a discount code available for you guys as well if you would like to purchase anything so they have a 10% discount which will be Laura 10 so I will leave that on screen as well so yeah definitely check Luna Gifts out okay moving on to the next small business now this next small business if you are a sweet lover and have a super sweet tooth like myself you are going to love this small business um, and they are called Sugar Sweetheart UK so it's by a lovely lady called Leah which funnily enough she literally lives down the road from my um, family home. Um, it's crazy sometimes like how this internet space, I have people following me that literally live so locally. But anyway, essentially Sugar Sweethearts UK is a sweet business. She sells a ton of different variations of like pick and mix. Um, she does these gorgeous boxes. Now, I'm not gonna lie, I have had a few because I could not resist when I seen the assortment in here. So this is one of like her Christmas boxes that she does. And as you can see, there's these compartments. Now, these were filled to the brim <laughs> when I got it. But yeah, I have tried some. In particular, you can probably see that this one right here, I have been loving this one. This one is so good. I mean, they all are good. But yeah, I'm a sucker for them kind of sweets anyway. These are like my fave sweets at Christmas. I used to have a big jar. Well, I still have the Christmas jar, as you guys know. But I used to fill it with these, and they're so amazing. 
Um, but yeah, this little box is so gorgeous. She's like decorated it as well. It all come beautifully wrapped with like a ribbon around. This would make such a good little stocking filler for if you've got a kid. I mean, anyone, but obviously, you know, because it's got like all the cute little elves and the Christmas tree and it's got like little snowmen and stuff in. I just think, yeah, it's so, so stunning. Um, she also does like huge bags to pick and mix to. So again, I just feel like these are really, really good stocking filler ideas. Um, it's nice that they come from a small business. And do you know what? I feel like you can't really get things like this in shops anyway. Yeah, this is the pick and mix winter edition that she sent over. So again, it has all different kind of like Christmas inspired sweets in. Um, and then she did also send over one of these cute Christmas lollies which looks like this. Again, this would look really cute in a Christmas Eve box if you do them for your kids. Um, or again, like in their stocking. Um, and also she sent these little Santa chocolates over too, which again would be really cute in a stocking. It's a stocking filler. So yeah, definitely check out Leah's business. Again, we'll leave everything in the description bar. Um, do you know what? I need to eat in one of these sweets, guys, um, because they are so good. Okay. Hopefully I haven't got any sweets stuck in my teeth because honestly, wouldn't you have one of those? You just want to munch on the whole box because <laughs> of that tasty. But anyway, moving on to the next business and it is another candle um, and wax melt business. So when um, I asked for small businesses to get in contact to do this video, I did notice that I had so many small businesses that were kind of like candle and wax melts and stuff. And honestly, I wish I could include you all. I wanted to try and make sure that if I was going to include a couple, then I included ones that had a different style because, do you know what I mean? I don't want to like tread on anyone's toes. So yeah, the two that I've featured in this video, I feel like are two different kind of like styles. So yeah, there's something for everyone. But anyway, this next brand is called Glass and Wick. And honestly, again, they have some gorgeous and stunning pieces. So they so kindly sent me over three different items. First up being this gingerbread luxury candle. So let me show you the packaging. So this is the packaging of the brand. First of all, just how stunning and just amazing is this packaging. Um, and then if we open up and I show you the candle inside, again, it's all beautifully wrapped in their own like glass and wick tissue paper. Look how sleek and gorgeous this is. So again, it's in a beautiful glass pot, just has real simplistic kind of like branding with the glass and wick logo. And then we just have a one wick gingerbread candle. This smells so good i'm a huge fan of gingerbread anyway i just love with gingerbread candles how you've got that kind of like ginger obviously undertone but like there's a lot of sweetness to it as well yeah smells incredible that does so can't wait to burn that and um, then they also sent me some wax melt which they kind of like wrapped up in tissue paper which i thought was cute um, and again the packaging on these are just beautiful so these are what they look like. Honestly, the smell coming off these right now is just insane. So again, just beautiful, beautiful packaging and branding. Um, we have the Myra and Tonka. Now I actually own a perfume from Jo Malone and this literally smells like that perfume and it's one of my favorite perfumes. And um, if you look at the wax melts as well, like look how beautiful they look actually in the packaging. Oh my god, I can't wait to put some of them on later, you know, like they smell so good. Um, and then I also got some Woodland Retreat ones. I'm gonna have a little look. Oh look, they all look kind of like funky. Love that. Um, and then they also have mauled wine. Oh, love a bit of mauled wine. And again, just beautifully decorated wax melts. And they smell so incredible. So those are those. And then they also sent me over a Latisse Fern Wax Melt gift box. So this is the branding and packaging for that. Again, so, so pretty. So I'm going to try my hardest to nicely open this and show you what is inside. Oh my goodness. So first of all, we have this gorgeous kind of like leaflet included, which is just so pretty. And then we just have like wax melt guidance on the back. And again, just look how cute this branding is, guys. Um, and then if I just kind of like tilt this up and show you, we have the wax burner here. And then, I'm not too sure what's in here, but let's have a little look. Oh, they've got like all little mini um, wax melts to go with your burner. So we have a Midnight Ember. 
seashells. Oh, it's all different scents. Oh my god, there's so many. Peony and blush suede, pink peppercorn and raspberry. Oh my god, the smell of these. Dark honey and tobacco, velvet, peony and oud. Still more, guys. Cuban tobacco and oak, lime basil and mandarin. Oh my god, there's still more. Nordic spruce and pom and deer. Is that how you say that? Oh my god. So there's literally one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten individually wrapped wax melts that come with this little burner. And again, there's a little um little kind of like leaflet inside. Ah, so it's from the G and W Unearthing Collection. So cute. I'm gonna pop that back in there. But how cute is this packaging, guys? And like the fact that they all come in this little like sleeve as well. That's so, so incredibly cute, honestly. What a gorgeous little gift. Um, so let me just pop them back in there. Let me just show you as well, just the wax burner. So this is what it looks like, just nice and white. Obviously, your little wax melts go at the top there. That is so stunning. Yeah, I think that would be a gorgeous present if you know someone that loves a nicely scented home. Uh, so yeah, definitely check out Glass and Wig. Again, we'll leave all the details and links to products in the description. Um, right, where do we go next? I think we've only got a couple more brands left to share and show you. Um, so first of all, I have a lovely lady that does cakes. So she actually bakes cupcake cookies, chocolate slabs, and her business is called With Love from Lillian. Now, obviously, because things were sent in the post, she had to be careful with what she sent over. Um, but she actually kindly sent me over some shortbread biscuits with, like, Merry Christmas designs on, Happy New Year, 2021. Um, how cute are these, guys? Let me just try and get one and show you. So that says, um, Happy New Year. That one says, Merry Christmas. Oh, it's so incredibly sweet. This would make a gorgeous like postal delivery to someone if you just want to send them a little special something. So yeah, definitely check her out. Um, and obviously, if you know local and stuff to her, you could get yourself some cupcakes and cookies and things like that, which are obviously a lot easier to collect. Okay, then moving on to the next small business. Now, this next small business is called EK Design. Um, and again, I'll leave her Instagram here so you can go and give her a follow. Um, and she actually sent me over her Christmas card collection. So this isn't a gift, but we all like a nice christmas card at this time of the year and you know shopping small and supporting a local business again this is a prime example of like a realization being hit of shopping small rather than going to a store and buying like a set of christmas cards and um, so she actually makes these gorgeous christmas cards and she sent me over her christmas collection honestly so incredibly stunning so she wrapped them all up in this gorgeous like string so they're all tied together. They all look beautiful, but obviously I had to open that up. So these are the envelopes it comes with. Gorgeous, like, brand envelopes with her EK Design, um, like, logo embossed on the back of it. So, yeah, let me give you a rundown of some of the designs that she has. So we have Merry Xmas, Bestie. How gorgeous is that? Just so cute and minimal. And, yeah, I really, really like that. We have Merry Christmas with, like, a nutcracker on. Is that a nutcracker? Um, then we have this one that says Merry Christmas. Then a similar one that says Christmas wishes. Um, one with ho 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 on. It's the most wonderful time of the year. This one with a little reindeer on. How cute is that? Lots of love to a special little one on your first Christmas. That is gorgeous. I really, really like that. Um, and then just these two kind of like simple ones. So we have happy Christmas with a little gingerbread candy cane and reindeer. And then Fizz the season and a glass of fizz. So yeah, some gorgeous Christmas cards there. And uh, like I say, it's from a small business. Um, and I just think supporting people like this is really special. So yeah, thank you so much, Erin, for sending me them over. And if you want to check out Erin's designs, then please go over to her Etsy shop and have a little look. Okay, so moving on to the last business in my gift guide now. I feel like this has gone so quick. Um, and the final one I'm going to wrap up with is actually a small business from a girl called Amy. And her Instagram is called Personalised Turtle. And she does um, hand-painted doormats. So she does like standard ones. She even does Christmas ones. And I just thought this was so cute. Do you know when you're really struggling to give someone something for Christmas, they've got everything, um, but if they've got their own home, how cute would a personalised doormat be? I think that's a really lovely gift, like I would love that. Um, so she has so kindly made me one that says, welcome to Laura's. So it's in this gorgeous kind of like grey matte and then white text. 
um, which like I say, she's hand painted on. So stunning. I'm just trying to be careful with this because obviously we've been a doormat. It's in that like doormat fabric do i say uh really good quality if you guys watch my amazon video can you remember when i ordered a doormat for halloween it was actually like a flim thin it was actually like a thin flimsy thing this is actually a proper proper doormat um so yeah the quality of this is insane and it's so beautiful and i mean who doesn't love a personalized gift sorry guys someone just knocked on my door so i literally just got caught off there so i don't know where or what i was saying um but yeah definitely definitely check out amy's business if you would like to treat yourself to a doormat or gift someone a doormat for christmas as well would be like i say the perfect gift something a little bit different um so yeah anyway i need to wrap up quite quickly because my camera battery is currently flashing um and i feel like i've chewed your ears off for enough so anyway guys i really, really hope you have enjoyed this small business gift guide and maybe saw a few businesses that you would like to support or maybe buy something from um you know like i say even if you just follow them on instagram and show some support it would mean honestly the absolute world thank you also to all the small businesses for sending over everything for this video as well and anyway yeah make sure you hit the subscribe button guys and i shall see you all in my next video Bye bye